So guys, welcome, welcome back to the TOD Project, episode three. Like I mentioned in the intro, I am here with our special guest, Hope Ellen. Hope, how are you doing today across the pond? What about Americans kind of like tips you off? You have, you can have no filter. I, I've probably what, what, heard. What, what a thing about America annoys me? Yeah. I mean, I'm just, I'm, I, I can't say from personal experience because I've never lived there. I've visited, but I've never lived there. And of course, media gives. Yeah, that's true. Only one side of a picture. So I'm going to say. I guess what, what stereotype or like what, what like generalization, I guess, rather than. Racism, the racism. Stream. That's, that's a big one. Yeah, that is a big mm-hmm. one. That's a big yeah. problem. And I mean, that, ha- that happens everywhere. That happens here. Um, and it's, it's inexcusable. Um, but obviously recent events this year, I mean, it's been going on for how, for, for all eternity, but, mm. um, recent events this year have obviously brought it to light. So that's probably not the funny answer you were looking for, but that's probably, <laughs> that's probably the, the biggest one, really. Let's be honest. Yeah, I was expecting like some like, oh, I hate you know, like, like your accent I, or like, I, I hate corned beef like or something, but no. Yeah, yeah, like something like that. But I mean, it's just, it's valid. 100%. For a spanner in the works, I like to, yeah. I like to uh, cause surprise. <laughs> yeah, that'll be that'll be it for me. <laughs> that is that is a big one. That's a huge problem. Like I don't even understand why it's still. I mean, I, I guess it's kind of naive me like saying I don't even know why it's still here because what you know, it's just what it is type of situation like. Yeah, but that that even saying like it is what it is is just, just past that point now, isn't it? It's just ignorance. Yeah. Uh, I mean, it happens. It's all over the world, isn't it? And the only answer I believe is is education, um, mm-hmm. and to essentially uh, eradicate all the racists. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I guess I'm gonna go. Hmm. About the what? I okay. thought you meant you were gonna go then. Hang up with me. I was like, no, okay. no, 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 no. <laughs> right, I'm gonna go. Okay, bye. So. I guess, I guess, I mean, well, you said you went to New Jersey. So I've been to New Jersey and New York, yeah. Yeah, so, I mean, there's a lot of people on the East Coast. So, like, I guess, I guess, like, what about American people, like, mannerisms or, like, the way they conduct themselves, like, socially? Just, like, you, like, not political or anything, just, like, you know? There's a lot. To, it's really funny, actually, because America and the UK are very aligned in a lot of ways, but in other ways, we're so so different. I don't like that American TV steals a lot of our ideas and tries oh, really? to redo it, like Shameless or The Office or The Inbetweeners. They're, they're Where was The Office from? Britain. Oh my Ricky God! Ricky Gervais. I had no idea. Yeah, that is well, literally one the of the, it's that's literally the one of the funniest shows I've ever seen in my life. Right, <laughs> right. And, but it was ours first, you know, it was ours. So, yeah, I don't like it. The, the, there's a big comedy difference a lot of the time, isn't there, with, with UK and American. Like, some jokes don't get, some people don't interpret the right jokes. I don't know. Oh, yeah. I feel like Americans can be more close to the line. Mm. Is that a thing? Like, like I mean, we're, that we're, we're more of, prone to like, words, Jared, but I don't know what it means. <laughs> we're, we're more prone to like get really close to the line and even cross it sometimes. And like, then like, and still like, oh, that's really funny type of situation. I don't know if that's in, in England. Okay. I get it. Like, so like, you know what I'm saying? Be offensive. Yes. Yes. And then people still laugh at it. But then do Americans laugh when people make jokes about Americans? Yes. Cause I feel like some Americans would be like, get offended. I mean, we're making really big generalizations here because not every American is the same. <laughs> so some might get, some might not, but they're just people. It doesn't matter where they're from. Well, so so that's, that's a crazy thing because this is one thing. When I went to London, this was a huge thing because, so obviously there were like me and like the group of my team, there were a bunch of Americans there at this convention or business, whatever. And mm-hmm. there were also, it was an international convention. So there were people from, from from England, obviously, there were people from Portugal, Spain, and like Brazil, and all over the place, and Germany, and Croatia, this, that, and the other thing. And I think I, d- I didn't see one single American flag there, but I saw thousands and thousands of different countries' flags, like people repping their flag. And I think that's a big difference with with America, with the United States, is like our connotation within America, like if you wrap our flag, like if you, if you put it around your shoulders and like either one, you're an athlete that just won the gold medal at the Olympics or two, 
like people think like if you're flying a flag on the back of like your car or whatever, like there's certain ways that like if people fly their flag this way, you're fine. But if you fly the flag this way, you're like racist or like stupid. 